Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. I am Josh132 from 132 Gaming, and today we're going to be doing Pokemon Unboxing Season 3, Episode 2. I have once again taken the liberty of opening the pack of cards before the episode started. I also have the rip card. The card that I always rip up. Yeah, Cooper and Kyler aren't here to rip it with me, but... Uh, we haven't really been able to hang out a lot lately, so that's unfortunate. They're moving, so that you know they're pretty busy doing stuff, so I can't really hang out with them as much. Anyways, let's get on to the first card. And I'm thinking about doing this classic style, showing it right up to the camera first. So this is apparently Charmeleon. Is that I don't even know if that's how you pronounce it, but um. Looks pretty cool. It has 90 health points and it can do up to 60 damage, which is cool. Let's see, what else do we got here? Hold on, let me focus it real quick. There we go. What else do we got? Second card up is a trainer called the League Staff, which I actually don't actually know what this does. What does it do? Draw two cards if Winden Stadium is in play. Draw two more cards. I have no idea what any of that means, but still looks kind of cool. Uh, all right, so the next card up is what's that called? I can't read it. Hold on. Swellow, and it has ninety health points. It can do at least twenty damage. But if you get a coin and flip it and it's heads, the attack does 40 more damage. Next card up is a energy. <laughs> I'm sorry there's a lot of noise, but my, my parents are just doing something. I don't know what. But the next card up is, if it'll focus, which it's not. There we go. It's called B-Brill, which is a pretty funny name. B-Drill, sorry. It's hard to read backwards. Um, and it can do 120 damage with its sharp sting. And it also has an ability called Elusive Master. Once during your turn, if this Pokemon is the last card in your hand, you may play it onto your bench. If you do, draw three cards, which is pretty cool. Next one up is, ooh, that one actually looks really cool. This is called Anyways, this card is called Terrakeon, I guess, and it does a hundred and f or actually it has a hundred and forty health points and it does 80 plus damage. Though if you have a stadium in play, this attack does 80 more damage, which is cool, I guess. I like that it's shiny, you know, it's a good card. Anyways, the next card on this list is, what is that called? It is called um, Electrike, and it has 60 health points, and it can do 20 damage with its bite. Pretty simple. Next card up is Dust Skull, or Dust Skull, or whatever. It has 60 health points, and nothing does damage, apparently. There's no damage numbers here. That's kind of weird. But anyways, the next card up is... Fan P. That's a weird name. <laughs> uh, anyways, the next card up, or actually, this card here is, um, it has 70 health points, and it can do at least 30 damage, though this attack does 30 damage for each damage counter on this Pokemon. I don't know what that means, because I don't fight with Pokemon, I just collect them. Anyways, uh, the next thing on my list, or on my list, the next card is I can't read it Beldum which actually that this reminds me of those old like those robot cards that we got uh, it has 70 health points and it can do 20 damage 
All right, the final card on our list is we Weedle. It has 40 health points, and it does no damage. Though it does have this thing called a Bug Hunch. Um, search your deck for up to two Leaf Pokemon, reveal them, and put them into your hand. Then, shuffle your deck. And that is it. These are the cards. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Hold on. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Thanks for watching, guys. I am Josh132 from 132 Gaming, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye!